the town behind us, progress was good. And then, it wasn't. My fuel gauge is just on the top of the red. Um, I don't have one. What I do have is the same engine as you, but a much heavier truck, so I must have used more. And out here on my shortcut, there were no filling stations at all. The needle is now nearly all in the red. I'm trying to use the tiniest throttle movements to just keep it ticking along. In the next village, James and I decided to pull over and dip our tanks. I've got no fuel. None. But it's a comes... smear on the end of the stick. What's the news? None. I mean, it's dry. I don't know what I'm running on. If you actually run a diesel out, you've got to bleed the system, it's haven't yeah. you? Yeah, and that's and mess. it's hours. Yeah. Yeah. Well, look, why don't you just go and snout around the village and see if you can find some? Why me? Because you're the youngest and the well, fittest. It's your fault we're in this situation. Your I know, but I'm cut. old and hot. It's your shortcut. Seriously. If somebody's going right, to go, actually. it's you, mate. Right, right, I'll go. Fuel. And as diesel. Much, as much as you can. Yes, diesel. What is Burmese for diesel? How do you mind diesel? Mime a lorry. Mime a lorry. Yeah. Uh, and then that. do that. Right, so I'm a, I'm a butler with Parkinson's and I've got a gun. Jeremy headed off and was gone for quite some time. Still quite hot, that. Done the oil. Have you? Are you reading Bridge on the River Kwai? Yeah, he's just gone into the Bad hut. News. But they... The... What? Bad news. What? I haven't been able to get any diesel. However, I had come up with a clever alternative. <sighs> no, you half-wit. <laughs> There's no diesel in this village, but there is diesel in the next village. So we use the horses to ride to the next village, get the diesel, bring it back to the trucks. We're not in a western. I can't ride a horse. Well, you what? Well, I might have been pony tracking when I was eight, but, you know... Well, it'll be in there, wouldn't it? Well, I wouldn't use that one there, if he's going to ride anyway. Holy moly! <laughs> Why do they have five legs in Burma? Maybe it's so it can milk itself. Should we spend... Mm. Should we spend all day looking at a horse's <laughs> willy or should we go? <laughs> Being the most experienced horseman, I took the frisky five-legged stallion. We're on. Oh, Christ almighty. Hello, horse. I shall call you Tesco. Ready, steady, go. Well, I've bought a stalled horse. It's going backwards. I've bought a reversing horse. I think if we get moving, yours might follow more readily. Come on, then. James, can you turn right and go up there? Come on, come on. turn around. Does anybody how do you make know a turn how around? to start a <laughs> Burmese horse? Come on, follow your mate. Yes, very good. The controls and are reversed. Off. I'm off. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Soon, James was getting a taste of what the ride was like in my sports lorry. My nadges are getting a pummeling. Ow, 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 ow. Look at this A-lax going on here. No, it's because my horse is going up your one's bottom. Oh, Christ, we've had an accident. Oh, God. <laughs> you go ahead. <laughs> I'm terrified. It's, my nads are killing me. <laughs> oh, stop that. Please don't fight. Walk on. I'll stop calling you Tesco if you promise not to fight. Go. <laughs> Walk. There, you, there you go. Ow, 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 oh. ow. Oh, God. Oh, God above. Not much further now, James. Jesus. I mean, Buddha. A few hundred yards further on, Richard Stallion decided to get amorous with James's mare. Oh! Let's go. Has he gone? What happened? It reared and mounted that. Don't get kicked. Things quickly went to pot. Oh. This is the doctor going to attend to Richard, but the van is stuck. I've just dismounted my reversing horse 
and actually genuinely have hurt my testes. Oh, I can see why they should be glue, these things. Richard was diagnosed with a suspected broken wrist and went on a four-hour journey to the nearest hospital. So I walked my horse to the next village to get fuel, and then we found a spot to camp for the night. Here, while I enjoyed the view, James unveiled his sleeping accommodation, a mountaineering tent he could suspend from his crane. So I'm gonna rest it against the front of the cab. So all these bitey ants, they don't get in your tent and eat you. It may have been insect proof, but soundproof, no. I want to go to bed, but I can't with that racket going on. Listen to it. The next morning, I discovered that Hammond was back. So that's just a sprain? Yeah, not bust. Nothing exciting. So you can check what is it you have yeah, to do. Yeah, be fine. Oh, it's steering. Yeah, yeah be all right. You just have to... Yeah, still do that. Right. And how yeah. was sleeping in your lorry? Um, not bad. What about yours? Mine. Where did James sleep in the end? What's he done? Oh, he's got some stupid high-tech mountaineering tent he's hung from his crane. Why is it up there? <laughs> well, you know he's snoring? Yeah. So I moved him a bit further away. Jesus! Clarkson!